favorable prognosis in neuroblastoma is seen in which of the following conditions. See, in neuroblastoma prognosis uh, has been quite a, a few times asked, especially in PGH Chandigarh exam, rather than in a NEET or an AIMS or a PGA exam, because it's it's easy to ask a multiple choice question on neuroblastoma prognosis. I'm sure it's difficult to remember. Actually, in 2016, when I uh, wrote something for neuroblastoma prognosis, I'm just going to share with you. I'm not such a good writer. Yeah, something in the form of a mnemonic. This is what I wrote. A young kid with a mature thought, okay, stands in the corner holding his pot, the belly, looks at the tiny little beautiful blues on his skin, wonders if it was the same which was making his blood go thin. Hardly there are less than 200 divisions in the world, right, a very good thought for the guy. United we stand, we make the enemies go curled. I am hyper and I have a trick to express. Rest all are absent, so there is nothing to depress, right. This is actually the mnemonic for neuroblastoma. Remember this, I will relate everything to our neuroblastoma prognosis, okay. I am a young kid with a mature thought. Okay, a young kid with a mature thought, neuroblastoma in infants, that's what I mean there. With a mature thought in the sense, the tumor is going to mature. Neurons, when they mature, what do they become? Ganglions, Schwannian, right? ganglionic differentiation, Schwannian differentiation, that's what I mean by the maturity or mature thought. Okay, so ganglionic or Schwannian differentiation in the tumor. Okay, definition in the tumor, standing in the corner just for uh, to fill it up, holding his pot, right, a pot, that's abdomen, liver, looks at the tiny little beautiful blues on his skin, what, do, what does it mean, perfect, the cutaneous metastasis, the blueberry muffin baby, right, wonders if it was the same which makes his blood go thin, blood originates from bone marrow, right, so here I am dealing with three things, skin, metastasis, bone marrow metastasis, liver metastasis for the point uh, for the pot belly, right. If it is in the liver, if it is in the bone marrow, if it is in the skin, when meds of neuroblastoma reaches all these places, I am going to call it stage 4 S, it is a special category stage 4 S, okay. I will go to the next line. Hardly there are less than 200 divisions in the world. The divisions here is going to be my mitotic index, right. If I am going to have less than 200 DNA index or the DNA ploidy or the mitotic index, okay. If the mitotic index is less than 200, okay, that is what that, that line means. Next one, united we stand, we make the enemies go curl, does not have in, any sense just for namesake. I am hyper, hyper diploidy and I have a trick to express, a TRK or TRKA, right. So, if the tumor is hyper diploid, and if TRKA expression is present, so all of these are present and rest everything is absent, I have nothing to depress, that is the last line. Nothing to depress means the patient is going to have a very good prognosis. If all these are present, all these points to a good prognosis, okay. All these points to a good prognosis just a way to remember in the form of a poem, okay. So, if nothing of this there, it is going to be bad poor prognostic marker because it is difficult to read both the sides of a table. Remember one, other one is going to be a poor prognostic marker, that is all. If TRKB, poor prognostic marker, NMIC, poor prognostic marker, DNA divisions more than 200, poor prognostic marker, less than 200, good prognostic marker. Stage 4 generally will think of a poor prognostic marker. Be careful here, stage 4S, not 4, 4S. If it is limited abdomen plus either liver or bone marrow or skin, good prognosis. Other stage 4, bad prognosis. 3, bad prognosis, fine. So, anything apart from this in a neuroblastoma is a good prognosis, right. So, now we will go back to the question. Remembering having this person in mind, we can go back to the question. Favorable prognostic feature of neuroblastoma, that is what they are asking. Near ploidy is poor prognosis because hyper diploidy is good prognosis, right. Enmic amplification, poor prognosis. DNA index greater than 200, poor prognosis, more ganglionic differentiation, good prognosis. The kid has a mature thought, ganglionic Schwannian differentiation, good prognosis. TRK expression, perfect, good prognosis. 
I have a trick to express, right? It's a good prognostic marker. These, this is how you're going to deal with neuroblastoma. Because prognostic marker are a bit difficult for you to completely read and go through it. So a tiny little trick for us to remember about neuroblastoma prognosis, right? Share with your friends so that they don't get worried about